waterproof lifetime lead warranty. No bulbs to replace ever. Waterproof lead uh, trailer light warranty is um, uh, pretty expensive. Um, 80 bucks or something like that. But, uh, anyway, so the model is uh, T. Basically, you get two big um, light bulbs, uh, two big lights. Um, then you've got a bunch of uh, wires uh, to hook up to the trailer, and this is the this is the plug that uh, feeds into the back of the trailer light and this is just for the trailer uh, hitch and there's also it also came with this uh, license plate which I don't need and also a bunch of uh, clips um, Oh, oops, oops, the light doesn't work. So this is the negative, which is the white wire ground. Yellow wire is driver side stop and turn signal. So let's connect. Oh, it's pretty bright. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So 14 LED lights, and you can see that's the yellow wire, the stop signal, and uh, it's pretty bright. Um, driver's side. I don't know how to test uh, the turn signal. Um, turn signal is probably here. The brown wire is tail lamp and marker and clearance and license. So let's see. Okay, so the bottom marker clearance um, and license plate light. You can see the bottom. Five of them lit up, going pointing downwards, and all the fourteen red lights above all lit up. You know, so you know the yellow um, stop and turn signal should probably work, and the tail light, marker light, clearance light should work. So this is like a one light for you know everything. Let's do the stoplight. You can see the stoplight is pretty bright. And the bottom one, the bottom plug, uh, bolt stone lit up. Okay, so we know this is good. We can uh, install for the. This is the driver side. I'm gonna do the same thing for the passenger side. driver's side lamp uh, dry test bench test before I install so here is the passenger side um, same thing white color wire is the ground like the instructions here says white color is the ground the green wire is the passenger side stop and turn signal that's the green and the brown is the tail light. So this is the green which is the stop and it's gonna be very bright before we connect this to the positive, we're gonna have to connect the ground to the negative of my battery. So this is the bench test of a trailer light before you install onto your trailer because the last thing you wanna do is 
you install this trailer let the uh, light and then you realize whoops the light doesn't work so the green wire is the stop and turn signal so let's see there we go so one two three four five five lights on the top four lights in the middle five lights at the bottom all work so this is the passenger side stop and turn signal okay and then this is the tail light for the passenger side so we're gonna try to connect this and as you can see these all work shoot the bottom one didn't work one doesn't work yeah unlike the you know this is broken you know unlike the unlike the other one where the bottom led lights will lit up that's why you don't want to install this before you bench test So I'm going to quickly show you the difference between this one and that one. You can see the brown wire. Yeah, I thought this uh, Optronics waterproof LED trailer light. The because this is the driver's side got these uh, lights. I thought the, on the passenger side it should have the same. Uh, lights as well, but no as you can see here these guys have five LED lights and they the passenger side. There's no uh, LED uh, uh, Five uh, LED bowls uh, like over on the driver's side because here is where you hang your License plate and on the driver passenger side. There's no license plate to be hung, So there's no license plate to be shown That's why there is no LED lights on this side. So there you have it. Um, um, so this uh, Optronics uh, trailer lights are good. I'm just going to install them, and um, you know, I'm gonna insert the bowls and attach uh, white wire from each light to a ground location on frame using two eyelet terminal and eight, number eight self taping screws and so forth, and then. Um, you know, run the yellow wire and one brown wire along the driver's side of the trailer frame. Attach three metal clips to hole wiring by, you know, drilling holes and stuff. And, you know, so that's how it's supposed to be um, installed. So now I'm ready to install these lights.